Hey, what's going on, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Real Sports Updates here. Back again with another video. Uh, so this weekend, Final Four weekend, we obviously got games going on right now. Uh, we got a big game going on between uh, Villanova and Kansas. Kansas is currently shellacking Villanova. So I expect Kansas to get to the uh, national championship game. Um, the marquee game of the weekend, though, no matter what the championship game is, the marquee game of the weekend is UNC and Duke. Um, and this is one that I've been going back and forth on for the last few days. Um, now, obviously, I think Duke had the better season um, as far as record-wise and stuff like that goes, especially with Coach K. You know, everybody is covering Coach K. This is last year and all of this stuff. Um, Duke has had the better season record-wise. But I think UNC is the better team. Um, and we've been seeing that in the tournament. Um, <clears throat> UNC has a legit big three, big four. Um, you know, I think I think Duke has – they have some talented players. You know, obviously, uh, Van Caro is, is the best of the bunch. Um, and I think he, he's probably going to be a, a lottery pick. Um, well, he for sure will be a lottery pick, probably top – he'll probably go top three um, to top five or whatever. But UNC is – I think they're on another level right now. They're playing on another level. Um, Manic, uh, Caleb Love, um, was the big guy, uh, uh, Baycott, Armando Baycott. All of these guys have been balling, um, and they are doing it from outside to inside as well. So I think they have, and they've been shooting the ball really well too. Uh, Caleb Love really went off um, in that that game against uh, St. Peter's last week. Um, you know, this is going to be one of the better better Final Four matchups that I can remember um, in my lifetime. This is one that I think a lot of people have always been looking forward to, um, and we've never seen it. You know, it's kind of surprising that we've never seen it, but it's here. So, me personally, I'm going with North Carolina. Um, like I said, they got a, a legit big three, and if R.J. Davis is playing well and if he's making shots, then they have a legit big four. So, it's going to be hard for Duke to stop Carolina um, at every, you know, facet of the game. Especially, like I said, they play inside out. Um, you know, I, I, th I think it was when they started off against Baylor, they kind of played, uh, you know, outside in. But they were able to put up a bunch of points. They made a bunch of shots. They made a bunch of threes. Um, Baycott was really on the boards. Um, and he's a defensive presence as well, too. So I think, I think Carolina, I think they do – I think they have a little bit of an edge. Um, I do think it's going to be a really good game, though. Duke is that I'm, I'm sure they have a, a, a bad taste in their mouth. Carolina spoiled uh, Coach K's last game um, at Cameron Indoor, so you know I'm sure that you know the the Blue Devils are going to want to you know get their lick back, as they say. They're going to want to get that payback, um, and they're going to want to send North Carolina home packing. But this is going to be a very good game. Um, you know, expect. I don't expect this to be a high, high-scoring game. Um, I think the team that makes the least amount of mistakes is going to win. Obviously, these teams know each other. Um, ACC, you know, this is the the biggest college basketball matchup um, ever, you know, of all time, you know, UNC and Duke. Um, but like I said, though, I think UNC is really – they've came into their own over the, the, the course of the tournament. Um, you know, I think the, the, the Elite Eight game – I think that really, really set them on a path to where you can look at them and say they they are probably right now, as it goes right now, they're probably the best team um, left in in the Final Four as of right now. Um, you know, things can change and all that stuff, but I think they are the best team right now. Um, and I think that if they win, you know, obviously they beat Duke. Um, then I think that they w they will beat Kansas. I think they are a little better than Kansas is, um, even though Kansas is playing well. Remy Martin. Um, <clears throat> I can't remember the big guy's name, but uh, they, they are playing really, really well. But I think UNC has another level. They have too many guys, um, and they have too many guys that can make open shots. So I've uh, been looking forward to this. been looking forward to this all week. But, um, yeah, so I'm going, with, I'm going with UNC. I'm going with North Carolina to uh, win tonight, and I'm going with them to win on Monday night as well too. So um, if you're watching the game, uh, let me know. You know, sound off in the comments. Let me know who you think is going to win. Um, you know, and uh, I'll I'll probably be well. Eh, I don't think I don't think I'll be able to live stream during it, but um, 
probably you know re record a reaction um, after the game as well too so um but that one's coming up soon so uh if you're watching enjoy the game sound off in the comments let me know who you think is going to win um and that's pretty much all i got for right now but uh i'll probably see you guys later on today so um yeah don't forget to like this video subscribe to the channel uh more content coming out soon and uh thank you so much for the support thank you thank you thank you thank you um that's all i got until next time